Hello friends, my name is Rupam and I welcome you all to Hello English. If you have not subscribed to my channel, I request you to subscribe. And if you have subscribed, a heartful thanks to you. So today in this video, we will discuss about 5 morning habits which can help you to become fluent in English, which can help you to improve your English speaking skill. And that also very fast. In my college, I was not at all good in speaking English. I'm from a small hill town and we never had that opportunity to learn and speak in English. But I never stopped. I always had in my mind that I have to do something different. I realized if I have to be successful, I have to master English. I have to be fluent in English. So I have changed few habits and I have added these five habits which I am going to show you. The habits which I have added in my life helped me a lot. It helped me to get a job in a big airlines company in India where I have to talk in English with all the employees. And that's not enough. I continued that habits. I continued working on those habits and it gave me so many things in my life. My boss used to like me. I used to get promotions, etc. So these five habits are all tried and tested. And I am here today to share with you. And if you follow this, I am sure you are going to become fluent in English. So let's learn about these five habits. Number one is, you may find it strange. You will say, Kya bakwaase? But that's the reality. But believe me, this habit changed my life. I always wanted to work for an airlines company. So, what I did in a big paper, I wrote, I want to work for airlines company. I pasted that paper in my room. Every morning when I got up, I used to see that and I used to tell in my mind the same thing. I want to work for airlines company. Believe me, when I was studying in my college, I got an offer from Kingfisher Airlines. It was one of the biggest airlines in India. See the magic. My college didn't get over. I was studying. By that time, I got a job. That also what I wanted, where I wanted. My dream came true. So what I want you to do? I want you to write in a paper that I can speak fluent English. Write it down in a big paper, poster size paper and paste it in your room. Every morning when you wake up, see that and repeat in your mind, I can speak fluent English. And you need to feel that slowly and steadily this paper is doing magic in your life. I had so many experience about this. Not only about the job, I wrote so many other things and I was able to get that in my life. So I'm sure if you apply this in your life, you will surely benefit. I believe in the magic. I believe that this paper, this poster can make magic in our life. Number two, when we wake up in the morning, our parents, our grandparents, they listen to bhajans, kirtans. In English, we say religious theme or spiritual songs. Same thing you can apply in your life. When you wake up in the morning, play one video. English words and English sentences video. Remember to play that video continuously for three to four days. Every morning when you wake up for the next three to four days, play the same video. What will happen? You will find 
that listening to that video, you are able to remember so many sentences and words which you can use in your daily life. You will be able to use those sentences, those words in your daily conversation. Suppose the video has 50 sentences. Out of 50 sentences, 20 or 25 sentences you will be able to remember and you will be able to use on your daily conversation. Not bad. You didn't knew these sentences. Now you can use these sentences. So try it out. Whatever video you play, you keep playing it for continuously few days. And yes, as our parents, grandparents, they work and they listen. Same way, you simply don't watch the video. You keep listening and keep doing your own work. Next, if you can, try to get a board, whiteboard and a marker. So whatever sentences you will be listening, from that you can pick up some words, some sentences which you feel can help you in your daily conversation. Write down those words. If you don't have a board, you can always write down in a paper or your diary. And you can use those words with your friends, with your boss, with your colleagues. So write it down. What is the importance of writing you can ask? The importance of writing is that when we write something, it stays with us for a long time. We can remember those things for a longer period of time. Now, you will say, then let me write the entire video. The video which I will watch, I will write the full video. But my dear friend, I know you don't have so much time. Maybe today you have time to write. Tomorrow you will not have the time to write the full video. So work on those skills which you can take for a long time. Not for something for one day or two days. Got it? So try to write and remember those words and sentences. Next we come to reading newspaper. This is a very important morning exercise. It is not simply reading. When you take the newspaper, you have to read it loud and clear. Let me show you. I have a newspaper with me. I will just show you how to read. Now many of you guys will be doing like this. You will be reading in your mind. No. What you have to do is that read it loud and clear. Okay. Today the sky is cloudy. The temperature will be around 30 degrees centigrade. So whenever you read, read it loud and clear so that it goes inside your brain. And you have to read continuously at least for 5 minutes. Now someday if you think, I will just read silently. You can read for your general knowledge. but that will not help you to develop your speaking. When can you develop your speaking? When you read it loud and clear. Number five, English with friends. What I used to do in my college, I used to find some group who is speaking in English. I used to mingle with them more because I know if I talk to friends who are speaking in regional languages, will not help me to develop my goal in life, to develop my English. So I used to search for group who speak in English and I used to communicate with them in English. Slowly and steadily I found my English is improving. Not only speaking with friends, online also you can find communities where you can engage yourself and Discuss with them, talk to them in English. One best thing about online discussion is that you don't know people. So, no need to bother. You can talk anything and everything. Search in Facebook, search in WhatsApp, Instagram. So many groups you will find where you can talk in English. So, my dear friend, 
these are the five morning routines which you can develop and see the change inside you. Let me know if these routines are helping you. I wish you all the best. Thank you so much.